hello everyone in this tutorial i will show you how to create a donor chart in excel okay so let's get started here is an example showing the percentage progress of a project now to create the donor chart go to the insert tab then from the charts group you will see the insert pie or donor chart option from there choose the donor option and you get this donor chart okay you can modify the chart area using the small circles like this now right click on the chart and then choose format data series okay and reduce the donut hole size as required okay now notice that there is a small gap between the sections okay to reduce the gaps let's select each sections first to do that first select the entire chart and then select the that particular section again this will select only this portion of the chart now right click on it and then choose the outline color as the same as the fill color okay so this one and then do the same with the other sections okay so now you can see there is no gap between the section okay now to add the data levels use the chart element menu from here and check the data levels checkbox okay for this case we don't need the data level for the ongoing portion so press delete or backspace to remove that data level and then for this one let's make it bold and increase the text size like this and just drag the level to the center like this okay now if i change the ongoing percentage to let's say 40 percent or sorry let's say 30 percent then the level changes to 70 percent as it is directly linked to the source data in here okay but you may need to realign the level for later on let's say, suppose let's change it to 20 percent and the data level moves aside as does the or as the section for the completed version increases okay so you may need to realign the data level so keep this in mind okay you can change the chart title like this okay so this is one way to create a donor chart in excel okay sorry I... looks good okay so this is the leader lines so let's increase the size a bit and the leader line will no longer be visible okay now let's see another example here we have some categories and corresponding sales amount now let's insert the donut chart okay let's modify the title a bit okay now select the chart and format data series reduce the donut hole size like earlier okay and from the chart element menu enable the data levels as we not want the real data rather the corresponding percentage just go to more options and then first check the percentage checkbox and then uncheck the value checkbox okay now we get this percentage levels okay let's increase the text size of the data levels like this okay and to remove the gaps you need to select each sections and then change the outline color to the fill color okay like this one so this one
okay so this one didn't work okay now there is no gap between the sections okay so this is another example of how to create a donut chart in excel okay let's see another example okay so here is the data set showing the sales of four sales in four different quarters okay the categories are the same now let's insert the donut chart and we can see there are four rings in the donut chart whereas in the earlier examples there were only a single ring in each cases okay so this is a bit different okay so first right click and reduce the donut hole size okay like this okay now select each ring to do this first okay so if you select it first time only a single ring will be selected then right click on it and then for the outline let's choose black do the same with each of the rings okay and the then the donut chart will look like this to add data levels use the chart element menu as earlier we do not want the actual data rather than percentages so enable percentage and uncheck the value okay you need to do this for each of the that uh, data levels uh, from each rings okay so keep this in mind okay let's just okay now for this one sorry we need okay so hello okay so for this one okay so you need to do this manually one by one unfortunately get 12 okay so we need to set this to 12 also okay and the final one so bold and size is 12 okay you can change the title to let's say quarterly sales okay let's change it to full screen okay now the donut chart is looking like this okay if you want the legends for the categories you need to do it manually inserting text box and then using arrows to indicate each ring for each category for example the innermost ring represents the clothing category okay so for example if i select the in central ring then the clothing category the data from the clothing category is being selected okay that means the inner ring represents uh, the clothing category okay so this is another example one how to create a donut chart with multiple rings in excel hope you find this video useful please like comment and subscribe thank you for watching and i will see you in the next video